As Southwest Florida recovers from Hurricane Ian, there are still questions tonight about how well our mangroves protected our coastline. Fox 4 meteorologist Andrew Shipley joins us live with more on how scientists have learned in the past that mangroves have saved us billions of dollars, Andrew. Yeah, while it's still too early to know how much protection mangroves provided during Ian, researchers who studied uh, say that Hurricane Irma in both Lee and Collier County saw more than a billion dollars in savings and economic benefit that they want us to look forward to in the future. There's a lot of research that suggests they're really good for um, essentially absorbing or sort of attenuating wave energy, which essentially means you're, you, you might decrease the amount of storm surge that's actually going to get to whatever's behind those mangroves. Along with reducing energy, Dr. Carrie Schumann with the Sanibel Captiva Conservation Foundation says mangroves also provide protection from coastal erosion. So they sort of capture sediment that comes in and into those systems during tidal cycles and they build up the ground beneath them. And and so, right, they, they are really good at preventing erosion and building up uh, in height over time. Another form of natural protection comes in the form of beach dune ecosystems. Think about mangroves a lot, but our beach dune ecosystems uh, we have these incredible dunes that are more herbaceous plants. So this is where we don't have those mangroves to protect us. And you don't think about those dunes and how much they protect, but they really do help. When we have storm surge coming in and it hits this large dune, that again reduces a lot of that wave energy. Dr. Chad Washburn, the vice president of conservation with the Naples Botanical Garden, says dunes are critical and alone could save millions of dollars in damage. Yes, we did lose some of the beach dune ecosystems, but they did their job. Those dunes helped to reduce that wave energy. So it really is important that um, we get back out there and rebuild these as healthy systems again. Dr. Washburn hopes we're considering mangroves and dunes as we rebuild from Hurricane Ian. Well, I really hope that we can look at the practices uh, that, you know, for the future and we can either help to rebuild or restore some of these mangrove and beach dune ecosystems, or we can protect what we have that are left. Meteorologist Andrew Shipley, Fox 4.